We're talking to our friend David Azarad recently for an interview on Fox Nation, and the topic of Canada came up. David Azarad was born and raised in Montreal, but like a lot of ambitious and freedom-loving people, he fled later to the United States. And because all the people who care about their own rights have left, Canada under Justin Trudeau has become effectively a dictatorship. And we don't like dictatorships. We're America. We liberate dictatorships. That's what we do. So we ask the obvious question, why don't we just liberate Canada? Here's that conversation. Why should we stand back and let our biggest trading partner, the country with which we share the longest border, and actually, I could just say a great country. I love Canada. I've always loved Canada because of its natural beauty. Why should we let it become Cuba? Like, why, why don't we liberate it? We're spending all this money to liberate Ukraine from the Russians. Why are we not sending an armed force north to liberate Canada from Trudeau? And I mean it. Well, I don't know. But that you don't I, have to answer. Yeah, that. I, I don't know that I'm 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 there yet with you. Uh, <laughs> I, 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 I'm just talking myself into I, a frenzy I, I, here. That's a fa- it's a fair question, and honestly, we thought the Canadians would be flattered because they're always flattered when you talk about them. They're like stalkers. You don't know they exist, but they've got pictures of you in their dorm room. So if you do a Canada joke on TV, they go absolutely crazy. They don't really know how to handle it or what it means, but it it doesn't matter. They're excited. And that's true even in the Canadian Parliament. Apparently, there's so little going on in Canada, like civil liberties, that if you tell a joke about Canada, they go bonkers. Watch this Canadian, quote, member of Parliament try to get some kind of resolution passed condemning this show. Mr. Speaker, after consultation with the parties in the House, if you seek it, I believe you will find unanimous consent for the following motion. That given the the rise of far right and associated violent extremism led to the attempted insurrection in the United States, the House condemns recent comments made by Fox News personality Tucker Carlson in which he suggests U.S. armed forces liberate Canada from the current prime minister. All those opposed to the honorable member moving the motion will please say nay. Nay, I'm afraid we don't have uh, unanimous consent. By the way, it, fa- it failed, and we don't want to be too picky or anything, but we did not suggest the armed forces liberate Canada. You're flattering yourself, Canadian member of parliament. We wouldn't need the armed forces. A couple of your college roommates just ran up the sled dogs and you wouldn't be able to move. We're not actually going to do it just yet. It's something to think about. Settle down.